so sorry that yeah hello see ya <laughs> oh, it's Baltic again oh there it is when I got my kid apart and when I get in and out I'll tell you about that, that little only a nine month old kitten in the tree at water there anyway it's a happy ending but RSPCA ought to be ashamed it won't come out and they said, um, if it's there another night, then <laughs> they will. Yeah. Been there all night already. Been missing all night. Oh my God, nine month old kitten. Anyway, um, I've got to track the owner down, I'm trying to lose down the road. But it's a place that oh, they wouldn't have thought of looking, neither. You know, which, anyway. I had to end up cutting the top part of the tree off because I couldn't even get to the tree with a ladder. It was blocked <laughs> off both ways. Yeah. So, um, to cut, you know, because I could get to over you to make a sort of like a bridge and use the ladder as a bridge to get to the tree. And then it would have fell out. Uh, brilliant guy to do that. Uh, to somebody who will lose on the street here. Um, yeah, I had to chop the top part off her because she wouldn't move. She wouldn't, couldn't get corks out with anything. She was blinking, but she, she wasn't moving at all. And you could only get as far as you could because it was too thin, right at the top of the branch where she was on. So we had to um, use a hacksaw, you know go back and get a little axe and just saw the top part off. I had to, <laughs> I just left them to it though then, as long as I knew she was going to get down and all that. Yeah, unfortunate for the tree, but yeah, bless. I thought she was frozen solid. I thought she was frozen to death, me. What a nightmare. And now this PCA, well, and the, the oh, the fire service said they can't come out unless the RSPCA are there and they want them to come out. In other words, we had no chance but to get her down. Oh God, I thought we were too late though. Anyway, happy ending, eh? I was looking, ladders, we couldn't even, nobody were in. Knocking on dive for ladders and like I say, just awful. Anyway, thank God. But it is, it's all check out here now. But RSPCA, like I say, uh, uh, got a cheek to put an advert on saying, we need your money so we can carry on with rescuing animals. And it shows you I'm putting a ladder to a tree, yeah, to get a kitten down. Hmm, okay, you fuckers. Whew. Sorry, I'm swearing, but my God. Left that cat up any longer and she would have had a hypothermia or what? Lucky she would have a little furry, little fluff ball. Plenty of air in other words, eh? Just as well. I don't ever want to see anything like that again. Oh my God. Not being funny, right? But it was only last week when that same night I filmed that cross, yeah? That I'd seen a big black cat in the tree. And if you look at my footages from that night, there is, there's a bloody black cat in the tree, a big one. <laughs> For people who have been following, that is, they'll know what I'm on about. Yeah. And then come out today, yeah. Well, it were another neighbour, actually. And they don't have a space here at eight o'clock and they won't come out. Yeah. Uh, Cause it was another neighbour who, you know, she's opposite actually, and she was taking kids to school. Yeah. Just after eight o'clock, they don't have this piece here. <sighs> and I wouldn't even. Oh my god. And it's been absolutely at minus conditions. And yet, oh my god. I just can't believe it. Sorry for saying this. <sighs> totally. Yeah, 
See what I mean, eh? Organisations like that. Animals don't stand a fucking chance. Yeah, well, we all know about these fucking... Mm. Never mind. Just goes to show her though. I'm shocked, me, you can't get over that. Better let that little cat die of hypothermia there. Eh? Freeze to death. I thought it was. Honest to God. And I never want to see anything like that again. Must have been up there all night. Been missing all night. And you think it'd me out? Well, obviously not. Going into shock, wouldn't it, and stuff. I am, honest to God, I am. I need to, ooh. And they're shaming these lot. Animal fucking charity, they're just bothered about the money. Quick enough to put black cats down, aren't they? Mmm. Animal charity. Animal rescue charity, should I say. I bet they asked what colour cat it was. Oh, it would surprise me. Anyway, guys, just thought I'd let you know of the update, happy ending, and that's the main thing. I'm glad I did my bit for it. I couldn't, I couldn't settle me. I never knocked on so many doors today. <laughs> yeah, crazy or what? <sighs> anyway, right. Catch you later, guys. Bye.